what happens if you make some MATLAB code and you want to use it on a computer which doesn't have MATLAB? Well, the solution is to make a Windows standalone application. And the way we do this is really simple. I have a project directory here with several MATLAB files and these run a graphical user interface. And the graphical user interface calls functions throughout its file and these functions all exist in my current folder. So to make a Windows standalone application we can either use the commands in the command window or we can use the uh, deployment wizard called deploy tool and we can select the files that way instead. So the way we do this is we type deploy tool into the command window. We then give our project a name and we give it a location. So we'll just pop this project on the desktop. We have a series of options here um, and we're going to use Windows standalone application. The next step is to add the files which we want to build into our application. So there's two types of files. There's the main file and there's the shared resources and helper files. The main file is, as the name suggests, the main file which is responsible for all of your function calls. So in this case, it would be findlygui.m since this is the file that runs the GUI and it's also the file which makes all of my function calls. So I'll click Add Main File and I'll choose findlygui.m. In the Shared Resources and Helper files, we add any additional files which are requested by findlygui.m. So in this case, it will be all of them except for itself and then a few other files which I know I don't need. These files all appear under the Shared Resources section. The next step is to package our project. So we have two options here. We can either continue to add files or folders, or we can add an MCR, or we can just proceed straight away to the build. Now, in this case, we'll want to add an MCR because we're packaging our project to potentially computers which don't have MATLAB. The MCR is MATLAB Compiler Runtime, and this is the, uh, the feature that you need to have installed on your computer in order to run executables which are running MATLAB code. Even if your computer does have a copy of MATLAB, you still need the MCR installed, so we will embed the MCR in the package. And here it is. Now what will happen is the uh, deploy tool will give us two versions of our Windows standalone application. It will give us a deploy version and a source version. The deploy version will have an embedded MCR installer. However, I've had some problems in the past getting this to work, so what I will do in addition is instead of pressing build, I'm going to press package. And by packaging the project, it will actually include an additional package file which will uh, it will run the installer for the MCR for us, so it will guarantee that we're able to install the MCR before trying to run our executable. So we'll put our package onto the desktop and click Save. We'll then have this dialog to tell us that it's building, and this can take a few seconds, it can take a few minutes, depending on the size of your project. Now that the build is finished, we can check to see that it works. So we'll check our desktop we see we have our Findlay folder and this will contain the distributable version of our application and the source version. We also have the Findlay package and if we double click on Findlay package this will expand into the installer, the readme and the executable and then it will prompt us to install the MCR However, this computer already has the MCR installed, so I can go straight ahead and run findly.exe. And I'm going to run it as admin because in the past I've had problems with getting these exes to work properly if they're not run as admin.
and here we go, a working standalone application that does not require MATLAB to run.